Well, Trike Theater is on a mission to enrich and transform the lives of young people through theater. We've got Chris Tennyson and Natasha Devon and Justin Mackey with us this morning to talk about one of their new shows. It's called A Dog's Job. Good morning. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for having us. For people who are not familiar with the storyline behind this play, tell me a little bit about it. Sure. Well, this uh, play, which is the first in our little trike series, which uh -huh. is for uh, three through five-year-olds, six-year-olds, this is about Phoenix, a young girl who's getting ready to go off to kindergarten, yeah. and uh, she comes to find out that her dog is really sad and lonely sad, and doesn't yeah. really know exactly what his job is now that she's going off to kindergarten. So it's a very sweet story. It's very <laughs> relatable, too, to a lot of people oh, who have yeah, pets. absolutely. <laughs> it makes you wonder what actually goes through their minds. <laughs> <laughs> right? Oh, yeah. Right. I know yeah. that there's also some great lessons and things for these children there to learn are. through this play. Tell me a little bit about sure. that. Sure. So uh, part of this covers just kind of the curriculum competencies uh, that kindergartners are learning mm -hmm. about jobs and community helpers and right. that kind of thing. The other thing, and maybe the more important message of the show, is it's a great look at compassion mm. and comforting your friend and what roles friends have in making each other feel better and dealing with those stressful times. And a really good message yeah, to share with these young people. When and where is this play? So this is place? a trike theater in yeah. Bentonville. Okay. The 21st and the 28th at 3 and 4.30 mm -hmm. are our public performances. Okay. And you can get tickets by going to www.triketheater.org. Okay, we're going to actually give you a sneak peek um, as to, you know, a scene from this play yeah. to give you an idea of what it's all about. So I'm going to let you guys take it away as we head to break. Sure. I'm so very glad you're here. There's something wrong with my dog, and I don't know what to do. Maybe together we can figure out what's wrong with Bob the dog. Bob, Bob, will you come out, please? Oh, please, it's me, Phoenix. Okay. What's wrong? You wouldn't understand. Well, I might. And even if I don't, maybe our friends will be able to help us. Will you mm -hmm. wave hello to our friends? It's okay. Friends. What's a friend? Oh, a friend is someone you care about. Someone you can talk to and play with and well, they can even make you feel better when you're sad. <laughs> I am sad. <laughs> I know you're sad. I can see it from the frown on your face and I can hear it in your sigh, but I don't know how to help you unless you tell me why you're sad. Okay. Well, Tomorrow you go to kindergarten, so Grandmom won't be coming over, so I'm going to be here all alone, all day. I'm going to be so bored and lonely. Oh, Bob, it's okay. It's going to be okay. Well, we'll think of something you can do. I've got it. Yes? You should get a job. A job? Yes. Whenever I'm bored, my dad tells me, get a job. So, you should get a job. That way you won't be bored. Okay. <laughs> What's a job? <laughs> 